Strangers from distant lands, friends of old, you have been summoned to answer the threat of Mordor. Middle-earth stands upon the brink of destruction. None can escape it. You will unite, or you will fail. Each race is bound by this fate, this one doom. Ring forth the ring, Frodo. of Mordor. Why not use the ring? Let us use it against him. You cannot wield it. None of us can. The one ring answers to Sauron alone. It has no other master. The Aragorn is right. We cannot use it. Let's be rid of that. Yeah. Yeah. Ah. The ring cannot be destroyed, Gimli, son of Glorin, by any craft that we here possess. The ring was made in the bars of Mount Doom. Only there can it be unmade. It must be taken back deep into Mordor and cast back into the fiery chasm from whence it came. <laughs> One of you must do this. One does not simply walk into Mordor. Not with 10,000 men could you do this. This is folly. Have you heard nothing Lord Elrond has said? The ring must be destroyed. And I suppose you will think you're the one to do it. And if we fail? What then? What happens when Sauron takes back what is his? I will be dead so far as in the ring and hands on us! I will take it! I will take it! I will take the ring to Mordor. I will help you bear this burden, Frodo Baggins. As long as it shows to bear. If by my life or death, if I can protect you, I will. You have my sword. And you have my bow. And my axe. This is indeed the will of the council, and I will see it done. Here! Mr. Frodo is not going anywhere without me. No, it is hardly possible to separate you, even when he is summoned to a private council, and you are not. Oi! Where can I go? <laughs> Nine companions. So be it. You shall be the fellowship of the ring. Where? Where are we going? <laughs> 